हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू लॉ लर्निंग स्कूल आज की वीडियो में हम डिस्कस करेंगे एम सी क्यूज जूरिस्टूडेंट्स के जो कि इम्पॉर्टेंट है हमारे यूजीसी नेट लॉ के पेपर के लिए इसीलिए आज हम जूरिस्टूडेंट्स uh, uh, के एम सी क्यूज डिस्कस करेंगे नेक्स्ट वाली आने वाली क्लास में हम पूरा ही यूनिट वाइज एम सी क्यूज को प्रैक्टिस करेंगे ओके देन फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज हु एमंग द फॉलोइंग डिफाइंड लॉ एज द अबस्ट्रैक्ट Expression of the journal will existing in and for itself. Friedman, Druitt, Hegel, and Savigny. The right answer is Hegel. And the next question is according to which jurist law is essentially a social fact which regulate the conduct of each individual in the community. Community. Then option one uh, A is a Druitt. Option B is a Austin. Option C is a Salmon. Option D is a Herring. Then right answer is option A. Do it. And the next question is: Law emanates and is enforced by the state. He believe that there is a confluence of command, sanction, and sovereignty in law. Who give his definition? Option A is Austin. Option B is a Parker. Option C is a Blackstone. Option D is Savigny. The right answer is option A, Austin. And another question is who defined the law as law is a rule of action whether it be animate or inanimate, rational or irrational. Option A is a Volkist. Option B is a Dale. And option C is a Friedman. Option D is a Blackstone. The right answer is option D, Blackstone. and the next question is who among the following jurist classified law into the nine kinds of law salmon volkist and c is holland and parker the right answer is option a hall uh, salmon and the next question is a rule which prescribe a journal course of action imposed by the, some authority which enforce it by superior power either by physical force or by other form other form of compulsion uh, which kind of the law is it option a is a conventional law option b is a customary law option c is a imperative law option d is a price the right answer is option c imperative law and another question is who among the following was the main exponent of imperative theory of law is option a holland option b is a parker option c is a duit and option d is austin the right answer is option t austin and the next question is the human uh, law may be of kinds option a is a two kind option uh, b is a three kind option c is a four and option d is a five the right answer is option b three kinds and uh, the next question is in which of the following law there is perfect uniformity and regularity and are not subject to change option a is a natural and moral law option b is a physical and scientific law and option c is a international law option d is a conventional law the right answer is option b physical and scientific law and the next question is law of gravity law of motion law of air pressure it uh, are example of which kind of law option a physical law option b is a price law option c is a practical law and option d is none of these the right answer is option a practical law and the next question is which among the following law is also called the rational law option a is a conventional law option b is a natural law option c is a customary law and option d is a civil law the right answer is option b natural law and the next question is which jurist made use of the natural law to formulate international law option a kant option b law option c is a gratis and option d is a pufendorf and the right answer is option c and the next question is during which period natural law help in the development of the judicial and legal pro uh, process option a is a medieval period option b is ancient period option c is a modern period option d is all of these above 
the right answer is option a medieval period and the next question is according to whom conventional law mean any rule or the system of rule agreed upon by person for the regulation of their conduct towards each other option a lock option b il obey solomon option c volkist option c uh, option d is a do it the right answer is option p solomon and the next question is rule of a club or a cooperative society or any voluntarily organization or instance of a option a is a customary law option b is a civil law option c is a conventional law and option d is a none of these then right answer is option c conventional law and the next question is who among the following define the customary law as any rule of action which is actually observed by man when a custom is formally established it is enforced by the state as law a uh, law because of its general approval by the people option a is a salman option b is a hegel option c is a fufendorf and option d is a parker the right answer is option a salman and the next question is jurist like seveni and henry men have recognized customary law as far more superior to the law of the state option a is sociological option b is a philosophical option d or c is a positivist option d is a historical and the right answer is option c positivist and the next question is uh law or rule meant for a particular sphere by human activity option a is a civil law option b is a price option c is a international law and option d is a practical law then right answer is option d practical and the next question is the law of the nation of the uh, 18th century was named as international law by in uh, Nine seventeen eighty is option A Bentham option B is a strike option C is Austin option D is a lock then right answer is option uh, A is a Bentham the next question is who among the following defined international law as a rule of conduct which state feel themselves bound to observe and therefore do commonly observe in their relation with each other. option a is a salman option b is austin option c is a strike option d is a holland the right answer is a uh, option c and the next question is which of the uh sorry what is the full form of the abbreviation of pcij then option a is a permanent court of uh, international justice option b is a primary court of uh, initial justice and option c is a primary court of international justice and option d is a none of the above the right answer is option a permanent court of international justice and the next question is which case defined the international law as principle which are in force between all independent nations option a is a jg lotus case option b is a ss rose case and option c is ss lotus case and option d is s ov lotus case then right answer is option c ss lotus case and the next question is who defined the international law as the aggregate of the rule to which the nation have agreed to their conduct toward the one another option a is holland option b is austin option c is salman and option d is the russians the right answer is option d and the next question is according to the austin is will will out by and holland international law is mere the positive morality the natural uh, law and option c is a civil law and option d is all of these the right answer is option a positive morality and the next question is who among the following defined law as a body of rule for human conduct set and enforced by the sovereign political authority option a is a strict option stark and option uh, v is austin option uh, c is do it and option d is none of these the right answer is option b austin and the next question is according to 
which jurist international law is a big law and never reckless is still a law option is a seveni option b is a salmon option c is oppenheim option d is holland the right answer is option c oppenheim and the next question is where is the head quarter of international court of justice the uh, then option is heg option b is a geneva and option c is a paris and option d is new york the right answer is option a heg and and uh, the next question is who said that the state consent to the rule of the international law not because they do uh, they so choose but really because they have no alternative the option 1 is a professor a professor dies option uh, v is a her uh, herold lasky and option c is a lock and option d is a salmon then right answer is option b is a lasky and the next question is which chief justice in great britain held that the international law is not is ipso facto regarded as a part of united uh, kingdom law option a is a chief justice of chief justice of coleridge and op uh, option b is a chief justice of uh, brigis and option c is a chief justice of arden option d is a chief justice of kitchen kitchen and the right answer is option a okay and the next question is in which case in great britain it was held that the international law is not ipso facto regarded as the part of united uh, kingdom law uk law and then option d option d is the right answer friends uh, franconia case theek okay? hai and the next uh, question is which branch of the international law regulate the practice of the capture of ship and cargo in the war time option a is a practical law option b is a prize law option c is a conventional law option d is a customary law then right answer is option b is a prize law and the next question is who among the following disagreed with the view that prize law should be regarded as a branch of international law and option a is a seveni option b is a pufendorf and option d is a do it and option d is a salmon and the next question is the term civil law is derived from the word civil uh, just civil civil is option a is a latin option b is roman option c is a greek and option d is a french then right answer is option b uh, roman and the next question is the force of the state is the sanction behind a prize law international law civil law and all of these then right answer is option c is a civil law and uh, who among the following regard regards only divine law and human law as law proper option a is austrian option b is alaski and option c is a lock and option d is a parker the right answer is option a austin and the next question is john austin classified law into how many categories option a is a 4 option b is a 5 option c is a 3 and option d is a 6 the right answer is option 4 option a 4 holland classified law into how many categories holland uh, ne classify kiya hai law ko kitni uh, category categories mein no option a is a 2 and option uh, b is a 3 and option C is a four and option D is a five. The right answer is option D. And the next question is Holland classified law according to their jurisdiction, role, function, and uh, none of these. The right answer is option C, function. And the next question is under which law the parties to a case may either be the natural or a artificial person, and the state only act as the arbitrator uh, throw uh, arbitrator throw its court as option a is a public law option b is a private law and option c is a special law option d is a general law the right answer is option b private law and the next question is constitutional law administrative law and the criminal law and the criminal procedure are the subdivision uh, of which 
law option a is a public law option b is a private law option c is a journal law and option d is a special law law the right answer is option a public law the territorial law of the country is called public law private law journal law and the special law the right answer is option c journal law and uh, well, uh, which consist of the uh, those uh, legal rule of which the court take judi uh, judicial notice as option a is a private law option b is a journal law option c is a special law and option d is a public law the right answer is option b is journal law and the next question is who among the following pointed out that the true test of distinction between the journal law and the special law is the judicial notice option a is a 70 option b is a lock and option c is a ventham option d is a uh, salmon the right answer is option d salmon option uh, the next question is the maxim ignorantia jurist not exudes at uh, a applies to uh, the special law journal law both a and b and option d is a none of these the right answer is both a and b who said the source of law include the material from which the uh, judge obtain rule for deciding case option a fuller option b is a professor dice and option uh, c is dr k c l n option d is a lasky and the right answer is option A, Fuller. Okay, our 45 questions complete ho chuke hain aur baki hum next, uh, next part mein uh, other question ko discuss karenge. Yadi aapko aaj ke questions aur video achhi lagi hai, then do like, share and subscribe. Press the bell icon for further notification. Aur saath hi saath mein aapko batati chalu ki mainna yaha subject wise playlist benai hai. Yadi aapne uh, subject wise uh, video ko dekhna hai, aap jurisprudence uh, dekhna chahate hain complete तो यहां मैंने जुरिस्पिडेंस के लिए अलग से प्लेलिस्ट बनाई जिसमें सारे ही टॉपिक डिस्कस करे हैं जो कि एग्जाम पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू के लिए जरूरी है ओके थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग डू लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब प्रेस द बेल आइकन फॉर फर्दर नोटिफिकेशन थैंक्स फॉर वाचिंग